What would you think of a life-threatening disease that affected 30 million people worldwide back in 1985? And then just 25 years later, in 2010, had ballooned to 285 million, which was an increase of almost 1,000%. Wouldn't that be an epidemic, a plague, even a crisis? If it continues at that same rate over the next 25 years, it would threaten 3 billion people worldwide, which is almost one half of the world's population today. This disease is the number one metabolic disorder, and it's the number one cause of blindness in the world today. It's kind of scary. I'm talking about adult onset, non-insulin dependent, or what we commonly now call type 2 diabetes. It accounts for 90 to 95 percent of all diabetes, and is caused by either insulin deficiency or insulin resistance, and it creates an unhealthy increase in, in blood sugar. Common symptoms include increase in thirst, frequent urination, visual problems, peripheral neuropathy, and increased infection and disease. The number one cause of type 2 diabetes is obesity, but there are other contributing factors also, such as uh, poor diet, sedentary lifestyle, certain medications like the statin drugs, advancing in age, uh, people over 45 get it more commonly, genetic factors such as Hispanic and African American descent. Complications associated with type 2 diabetes are heart disease, stroke, visual problems, kidney disease, limb amputations, sexual dis dysfunction, dementia, and also Alzheimer's disease. Now some fairly simple changes in our lifestyle can actually be of great benefit in combating type 2 diabetes. And they're simple things such as regular exercise, weight control or weight loss, lower blood pressure, and a vegan diet, which would also include the Sun Warrior superfoods. So the message is this, control your lifestyle or your lifestyle will control you.